Hello there and welcome to a brand new episode of Spotlight on Sports. My name is uh, Tariq Al Aryan, and we're coming to you live tonight from the Ministry of Information Studios right here in downtown Kuwait. And I hope everyone out there is having a nice evening wherever you may be watching this week's episode right here in the state of Kuwait or wherever you may be tuning in around the world. Well, first off, uh, we're going to start out with a local football match that took place. Recently, the University of Dundee in Scotland was in Kuwait as part of its collaboration with Desman Diabetes Institute in terms of education, training, and health informatics. Towards the end of the visit, Desman Diabetes Institute organized a friendly social football match which pitted DDI, that's Desman Diabetes Institute, versus the University of Dundee. Great fun was had by all. Let's now take a look at this match and some interviews and then we'll be back with you. Stay tuned. Tell us about today, sport day, and it's open day for Dasman Diabetes Center. Tell us, what's your impression about it? Today's event really is a football match between Dasman Diabetes Institute and our colleagues from University of Dundee in Scotland. I'm Scottish myself, but I'm playing for mm -hmm. uh, Kuwait today. Okay. <laughs> it's really just to uh, show like, the, the importance of athletics and sport, um, because as you know, d diabetes is not just about diet and right. control of your diet, it's also about getting active and doing something healthy. Happened to be the hottest day of the year so far, mm -hmm. but uh, okay. we're surviving, we're doing okay. Okay. Uh, what's your message for, uh, especially for the youth, and to exercise, to make... Uh, There's lots of exercise you can yeah. do. You don't have to come out to a football park. Um, you can go to gyms, you can do exercise at home. A lot of kids these days like uh, different games to play. You can play Wii Sports. There's a multitude of different games, tennis, bowls, mm -hmm. etc. You can do in the comfort of your own house. So I think people often use the weather as an excuse not to come out. And of course, it is quite dangerous in the heat of the day. But perhaps come out after five o'clock in the evening or even early morning as a family. It's a nice family thing to do. Get involved and uh, play some sport. Get active. Yeah. So then, thank you very much and wish you good luck. Thank you very much. Okay. 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 Salam alaikum. My name is Professor Andrew Morris. I'm the Dean of the School of Medicine at the University of Dundee in Scotland. We've been coming to Kuwait for three years. I think this is my 14th time in Kuwait. And every time we come, we play football. And Scotland has never won. So today we've flown in people from Barcelona, from Real Madrid, and Paris Saint-Germain in the hope of winning. But sadly, we're still not winning. But actually, this is all about exercise, because we're collaborating friends and colleagues in Kuwait and trying to tackle the problem that diabetes poses society back in Scotland and in Kuwait. And exercise is just such an important part of lifestyle. So we think we should practice what we preach. So every time we come, we play football and we enjoy it. And hopefully, sometime soon, we will win. I hope that and we'll have a good luck. Thank you. You're Thank you. Young. And if you'd like to play for Scotland, you're very welcome. Okay. 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 <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Uh, I like to do some swimming, you know, just some laps in the pool. About 30 laps between 10 and 11 o'clock, 12 o'clock. Mm -hmm. Nice weather, so you just do some laps, get in the water. That's good for the fitness, you know, it keeps the heart going, keeps the body pumping. Um, normally then I take a rest, I have lunch. 
maybe I'll have some water, drink some water just to keep hydrated because it's so hot here. Mm -hmm. You know, and then normally in the afternoon I coach football with little kids, like five, six, seven year old children, and uh, we'd make them have lots of water breaks as well. But it's good for the fitness, you know, the coaches will make them do drills and then we all play a match afterwards. And then sometimes after we'll have a kick around, just the coaches, like half an hour, 40 minutes, mm -hmm. um, just running around, just doing up, down, passing, quick right. passes. Just keep the body going and keep it moving. Yeah. Um, yeah. So and then wish you good luck. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. okay. Thank you. Okay. And change for their lifestyle. I think there are loads of opportunities in Kuwait. I think those that say there aren't are just perhaps not wanting to get out there. Here we are now in the 40 degree heat, okay. having loads of fun. We're really lucky, although the city is very condensed, mm -hmm. there are lots of opportunities, lots of parks, lots of stadia where you can play. Everyone's got swimming pools, and even if you're just strolling along the beach, mm -hmm. just making it leisurely as a family stroll, it's the right thing to do. Yeah, okay. Stay fit. So I wish you a good luck and thank you. Thanks very much. Okay. Okay. Best for people for exercise and change their lifestyle. Well, exercise is really important, uh, and so this is a good example of it. You see mm -hmm. lots of people from Kuwait, from Scotland, right. running about playing football, and it's 35 degrees. So, so it's good. It's good fun. It's good entertainment. You're amongst friends, so it's a little bit competitive as well. Uh, and you get to try out your skill. Yeah. Some of us old men, right. we have no yeah. skill, <laughs> but we still get to run about. Yeah. So exercise. Fantastic. Yeah. yeah. Is it the first time that you play in this weather? No, I, I've been. This is my 14th time in right. Kuwait. Oh, so okay. I've been here in uh, June, July, right. and August. So right. I played. Um, it's pretty hot just now, but uh, you know I've played like ah! this before. Yeah. It's good fun. It's great okay. fun. We're having a great time. Mm -hmm. So uh, thanks very much for coming along Thank to the video. Right. And wish you a good luck. I'm going to try and score a goal. Make sure you get okay. it on camera. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Okay. okay. Can start. Yeah. Uh, actually, we do this every Tuesday. Uh, it's an uh, open day for football. We do it uh, internally between the Osman employees. But usually when we have uh, guests like the Scottish guy and the uh, British son, we invite them to play with us. And uh, whoever wants to join is uh, welcome. Again, it's happening every Tuesday between the Osman only. Uh, in case we have guests from Scotland or Harvard, we invite them to play with us. And everybody wants to join if it was from the Osman or outside the Osman is free to join and uh, I strongly uh, strongly recommend that everybody should play football and do some sport right. because it's the number one uh, uh, how to say the medicine to fight diabetes. Right. Thank yeah. you very much and wish you good luck. Thank you. Okay. So we play football every uh, Tuesday at 6 o'clock. It's okay. part of an initiative uh, from the Sman Diabetes Institute to promote uh, sports right. and physical activity because uh, you know, an increased uh, weight and BMI is one of the risk factors for, for diabetes. So we try and, you know, promote sports amongst the employees and, you know, friends of the employees. And uh, as my colleague said, when we have guests, we also try to promote them as well. So it's a bit fun. It's a bit hot. Okay. But, uh, we enjoy it and it's very good exercise and uh, everybody should exercise. Okay. So I wish you a good luck. Thank, Thank you very much. much. Thank you very okay. much. Cheers. Okay. Guys, yeah. Hi. Tell us uh, about your ambition about today as a sport open day. Uh, yeah. It's good, it's encouraging. The, the goals, uh, they're opening up all around Kuwait now. Mm -hmm. It's good for Kuwait football, it's, it's encouraging. Look, people play right. every day, it's good. It's good yeah. mm -hmm. What about the weather? Do you face any <laughs> problem? Uh, I can't play today because it's too hot. Yeah, I okay. just flew from, from UK mm -hmm. uh, yesterday morning. Okay. I've been, it's my holiday, I've been swimming yeah, been okay. in the sun. It's too hot. So, I, yeah. so is that, that first time that you play with this weather, right? Yeah, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. too much. Yeah. Yeah, okay. What's your advice for, especially for the youth? Uh, as you know now, uh, the change of lifestyle. Yeah. They're using iPad, iPhone, and they, the whole day they are stand. What's your advice for them? Yeah, well, with the iPads. So, Q8, the youth, they like football, the past I know. Right. So, they're watching football on their iPads. So, in a way, it encourages them to go out and play football and mm -hmm. improve. But also, if too much sitting and eating, then you're going to get fat. Okay. So it's a good balance, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Uh, w w what's your, um, I mean, uh, what, what do you guess? Das man or Dundee will be the one? Which team will uh, you guess? I think, I think Dundee will win today. Yeah, yeah okay. So, so which, uh, uh, let's see which score. Like, what score? Yeah. I think it's going to be high scoring, maybe <laughs> like, maybe like 4-3 or something like that. Ah, wow. That's good. Yeah, yeah. Still, there's still yeah. time. Okay. So thank you and wish you a good no luck. No problem, thank you okay. very much. Bye-bye.
Well, we're back uh, right here in the studio, and that was a look at the friendly football match uh, which took place between uh, Desman Diabetes Institute and the University of Dundee. It was uh, 7 against 7, and the final score was 7-7, seven, seven. so it finished in a tie. Everyone had a great time, and that's what matters. <laughs>